Hello everyone, my name is Narissa and today we are going to be talking about eyelash extensions. So this video is a part of a series that I wanted to create to help people who maybe don't have a whole lot of experience with makeup to start to get their feet wet and start experimenting and learning new things. So I'm going to actually link down below the video that I did for a very simple foundation routine. And in this um, routine, I basically go through and I give you three steps on how you can create a simple foundation routine. Now today, we are going to be talking about eyelashes. So I know that eyelashes can be a bit much if you've never ever worn them before. I remember my first time ever wearing eyelashes and I, there were tears everywhere and I just couldn't get accustomed to it. But since then, I've have had more practice with them and I've become more accustomed to them and it's a great way for me to put a little extra oomph in my makeup looks. So let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so let's get started. First things first, your tools. So I have two tools that I think are very vital to you learning how to put on your eyelashes and they are tweezers. So you could have a pair of tweezers like this or you now also have tweezers that kind of look like this. Which I actually got this in a pack, Ardell. So this is the side that you use to help put on the lash so to hold your lash and then you can use this side to help push the lash down or secure it. So you need those utensils so you'll either need this or tweezers and once you start to get a little bit more advanced with putting on your lashes you'll actually even be able to put them on by hand. So the next thing that you also need is eyelash glue. So there are two different types, um, dark or clear. So this one that I have right here is actually, let's see if you can see it, get it in focus. No? No. <laughs> um, oops. Um, but this is the Ardell Lash Grip and it's in clear. And then I also have the Duo which is in dark and then one of my favorites is the sassy eyelash glue which you can purchase this at your local beauty supply store and this glue is not to be confused with a uh, quick weave hair glue this this is not quick weave hair glue you do not want to put quick weave hair glue anywhere near your eyes okay I'm going to repeat that one more time do not put quick weave hair glue anywhere near your eyes if you get um, eyelash glue and it looks like this, it should say eyelash glue on it, okay? So you need your tools and your um, adhesive or your glue. And then the last thing that you also need will be your lashes. So I have several different examples that I'm going to show you. Some of them I picked up from like Dollar Tree or Dollar General. Um, I picked up some things from the beauty supply store I picked up lashes from um, like higher end brands like mink lashes and so I'm just gonna give you some examples of different lashes that you can pick up and I'll also link down below some different lashes that I enjoy using so um, this is a pair I believe I picked up at the Dollar Tree and it's just a dollar so my advice to you is if you are just starting out to put on your lashes um, maybe pick up a couple of pairs from a dollar store or you know um, your beauty supply store because if you mess up you're not gonna be that upset we have another pair here that I also picked up from the Dollar Tree um, I picked up these from a Dollar General um, Oh, that was a lot. I also picked up these from Dollar General. Now, what you will notice is some lashes are thicker than others. So, that's going to affect how your makeup looks. So, can you see this? These lashes are not as thick as compared to, let's say, these lashes. Can you see it? So, these lashes that I have right here 
if you were to put them on they would be very very dramatic looking on your eyes whereas lashes like these would look a little bit more natural so it depends on what type of lash look that you're going for I also have some Ardell Glamour Night Lashes which I picked up at my local drugstore actually um, one of my favorite pairs of mink lashes are actually the M lash and I've done a couple of looks with these before and I will link this down below in the description box as well I picked these up the name is Soul Tree I picked these up from um, I believe Dollar General so with lashes there are all different types that you can try um, all the lashes that I just showed you here were um, strip lashes you also have individual lashes so these individual lashes are not to be confused with the individual lashes when you go to a technician who does who does <laughs> these individual lashes are not to be confused with the lashes that you get when you go to a technician who does semi-permanent eyelashes now that is something where someone will put in they've been professionally trained to put in individual lashes and then over a course of time maybe two three weeks those individual lashes fall out on their own that is completely safe if you go to someone who's properly trained and they use the proper technique this is um, these individual lashes you can put in and you can also use them for your makeup looks like let's say if we're looking at my lashes now and I wanted to thicken, thicken uh, my lash from here to here I could actually put individual lashes in to help give it an even more full look so let's go step by step so you need three items your tool which will be your tweezers your adhesive which is your eyelash glue and your actual lashes that you're going to use so with your strip lashes you want to put the adhesive directly on the strip as you see me doing here now using your tweezers you are going to hold your lashes that you've already put your glue on now with your tweezers you are going to place your lash down securing it at the middle of your eye first once you've secured your lash in the middle of your eye you are going to secure it on the ends as well now I'm going to use the blunt end of the tweezers to make sure that the lashes are secured down all along my eye Now you can see the difference with the extension and without. You do's and don'ts for your eyelashes. So you are going to want to make sure your hands are clean. So wash your hands. Make sure that you're using clean utensils. So after you use your utensils, make sure you clean and disinfect them again. Um, another thing do make sure that you are choosing a lash that you are comfortable with so you might start off with lashes that look a little bit more natural and you will build up to using lashes that are um, way more dramatic or sultry or anything like that it's really your choice do what you're comfortable with things that I would say do not do number one do not do not use 
hair glue for eyelash glue that is very dangerous um, it actually can take out your actual natural lashes and the hair hair glue can irritate your eyes so that brings me to number two do take care of your eyes when you have in your lashes or on your lashes so a lot of times people forget that in the process of them trying to you know um, do their makeup or look extra pretty or things like that there are certain things that um, are most important so your vision is most important do not put your vision at risk to wear lashes or makeup or anything like that make sure you are still taking proper care of your eyes and that includes not going to sleep in your eyelashes so once I get ready to go to bed for the day I'll take off all this makeup I will take off my lashes I will make sure that my eyelashes are clean of any lash glue I will and make sure you're gentle with your eyes so in the, this whole process of me taking off the makeup and things like that I'm still gonna make sure that I'm being gentle with my eyes as well um, so and then my very last rule that I have for everyone when they are doing their lashes is to have fun and enjoy because this is a part of your creativity like you get to make whatever makeup look you want and that you love so I hope that you've enjoyed today's video so thank you so much for joining me today in today's video I hope that you've enjoyed it please share with me what are some of your absolute favorite lash extensions favorites are pretty much anything by Ardell I really do enjoy their lashes and the M lash I really enjoy these mink lashes as well don't forget to like share and subscribe to my channel and follow me on social media. I can be found on Facebook and Instagram. I look forward to seeing you again very soon. Bye.